Hello everybody, this is Yole at Natural Health Secrets. We will talk about new health topics and share simple health solutions with you every week. In the last episode, we talked about the effect of heart disease on people's life and how does heart disease relate to our emotions and circumstances. Today we will inform you of the real primary cause you need to pay attention. Now let us see how MDs, medical doctors, explain your heart problem. Then I will provide a few simple natural healing tips to regain your heart health and regain your power to be yourself again. What causes weak heart muscles? So medical establishment says diluted cardiomyopathy is a condition in which the heart becomes weak and the chambers get large. As a result, the heart cannot pump enough blood out to the body. It can be caused by many medical problems. Hypertrophic cardiomyopathy is a condition in which the heart muscle becomes thick. So, the other question would be what really causes coronary heart disease and heart attack? And it is ultimately a result of inflammation from fatty material and other substances forming a buildup or plaque that accumulates within the walls of your arteries because these arteries have a crucial role of bringing blood and oxygen to your heart. Reduced blood flow can slow down or stop your heartbeat causing cardiac arrest. For this reason, medical professionals use a combination of lifestyle changes, medi medications and medical procedures to slow, stop or reverse the buildup of plaque. This can help lower the risk of blood clots forming and the heart attack taking place because it widens clogged arteries. Examples of medications used to treat uh, CHD include cholesterol modifying medications like aspirin, beta blockers, nitroglycerin, angiotensin converting enzyme inhibitors and angiotensin 2 receptor blockers. How long can you live with a weak heart? This answer is but webmd.com Although there have been recent improvements in congestive heart failure treatment, researchers say the prognosis for people with the disease is still bleak, with about 50% having an average life expectancy of less than 5 years. For those with advanced forms of heart failure, nearly 90% die within one year. What is the last stage of heart failure? The symptoms of end-stage congestive heart failure include dyspnea, chronic cough or wheezing, edema, lack of appetite, high heart rate and confusion or impaired thinking. Recent studies suggest a heart rate higher than 76 beats per minute when you are resting may be linked to high risk of heart attack. The better shape you are in, the slower your heart rate will be when you are not moving around. It might be okay to have a resting heart rate of 80, but it doesn't mean you are healthy. 
Your exercise plan should include aerobic exercise, cardio, running, jogging and biking are some examples. You are moving fast enough to rise your heart rate and breathe harder, but you should still be able to talk to someone while you are doing it. What are risk factors for developing a heart disease? High amount of free radical damage, also called oxidative stress, and low antioxidant levels in the body. When antioxidant levels are lower than those of free radicals due to poor nutrition and other lifestyle factors, oxidation weakens havoc in the body, damaging cells, breaking down tissue, mutating DNA and overloading the immune system. Being a male, since men develop CHD more other than women, although it affects both sexes, being over age of 65, high consumption of alcohol, smoking, eating a poor diet with unhealthy fats and processed foods, family history of coronary heart disease, stroke or peripheral arterial disease, menopause in women, having high blood pressure, diabetes or high cholesterol levels, physical activity or exercise, obesity, sleep deprivation, exposure to environmental pollutants and toxic chemicals. MDs also recommend heart healthy lifestyle to fight heart disease. Schedule a yearly checkup. Get physical workout for 30 minutes, four times a week. Eat healthy, don't overeat. Follow a low carb diet. Control cholesterol. Cut down on salt. Quit smoking. Convince your wife to stop smoking. Stay positive. Maintain a healthy weight. Lose weight. Lose 10 to 20 pounds. Limit your alcohol intake. Don't drink too much coffee. Switch from coffee to tea. Chew gum. Avoid raw onion. Limit your intake of carbonated beverages. Drink five glasses of water a day. Eat salmon on Saturday, tuna on Tuesday. Ask your doctor about vitamin E and aspirin. In the next episode, we will show you 10 signs and symptoms of heart attack, which are early warning signs, and what are the symptoms of a weak heart muscle. If you want to know more, don't forget to subscribe. You are welcome to watch our next video.